Hello sports racers, I am making another video on my garage saga. Uh, if you may have noticed by the large miter saw and drill press in the background, I am no longer in my living room. I am in fact in my garage. Now, why am I in my garage? Well, garage saga, yes, obviously, but also there happens to be a garage door in my garage. I know, very unique. So I wanted to show you this says closed, push the button. The fucking thing works. Let's click it again, bloop. All right, so that's definitely good, right? It's kind of good. So, hold on, let me just. Uh oh. Garage door is closed. It says open. All right. Well, that's definitely not good. So, um, there's one thing that's fucked up, but that's not what I wanted to show you. Uh, the thing that this particular video is about a uh, different fucked up thing, and that is um, that the main reason I decided to use this uh, device, Next Garage, as opposed to the other uh, garage door openers or home automation garage door openers that are on the market, like uh, Chamberlain stuff or uh, it's like GoGo -Go Gate, uh, is because this is supposed to work nicely with uh, Google Assistant or Alexa, depending on. Uh, you know, your flavor of artificial intelligence. So, the problem I'm having is it don't work. It works from the app. However, follow the instructions in here, which, by the way, they're out of date um, because it says to go to... Where are you, son of a bitch? Uh, here. So it says uh, in Google to go to more settings and then assistant apps. Uh, that apparently doesn't exist anymore. To actually link your account. The fuck is going on with this thing? Since it's open and it's red now. Anyways, uh, to actually link your account, uh, you have to go to Google Home. Come on, you son of a bitch. Focus, you fuck. There we go. You click on the upper right hand dilly wop here. Uh, and then you click on Explore, which will open your Google Assistant app. And then in that top thing, you're just going to type in Next Garage. Now, the reason I'm going through this whole rigmarole is because I want to show you that I actually jumped through the hoops correctly. So I have linked my account because if I hadn't, it would not say try it there, it would say uh, install or link, actually, more correctly. So it's linked to my Google account. It's linked to the correct Google account because you can verify that by scrolling on down and it shows you which Google account you are logged into right now. Um, you'll also notice that the top reviews for this thing both say that the app works fine, uh, but it doesn't work with Google. And uh, that just so happens to be the same problem I'm having. So let's go back up to the top of the app here and click on that Try It button. Okay, we're going to click it. And Next Garage isn't responding right now. Try again soon. And that's the response I've been getting across the board. And when I say across the board, I mean that not only does my phone have, before well, I trip over various junk in the empire of dirt, uh, not only does my phone have Google Assistant installed, but I have the house of the future and I have Nest, uh, and that also has Google Assistant installed. Hey Google, open the garage. I think I have to say open the garage door, Let's see if it's smart enough.
Yep. Oh, and I programmed it to say that. But it's not. It's not really doing that. Uh, so, um, yeah, so it's not working. So <laughs> I've sacrificed the uh, efficiency of my wireless network already for this fucking thing. Um, so I'm hoping there's a quick and painless solution so I can be all cool and all and open my garage with my voice because I don't want to live in a world where I can't do that. So once again, uh, next garage gurus, um, I throw myself on your mercy. Uh, also, I have another feeling that the reason it's not working is because Perhaps Google Assistant is connected to the 5 gigahertz connection uh, and, or I'm sorry, my Nest device is connected to that. Uh, and then of course the uh, fucking whatever it is, the, the Next Garage thing is connected to 2.4. I don't know. But then again, I have been able to get it work working from my phone and I've actually tested it where I have turned off Wi-Fi completely and just used my cell signal and Next Garage is working fine. Like I can open it with the app. It's just doesn't work with Google Assistant. <sighs> Even if I phrase it, you know, like, you know, tell Next Garage to open the door. You know, I literally, at the very end of this thing, it gives you a list of commands. Uh, they don't, they're not working. So please get this working. I, I have the sense that you're a small uh, dev team. Um, and really, I fucking hate big, you know, companies like Chamberlain. I'd rather, you know, have you guys make a good product. Um, so, like, anything I can do on my end to help you guys, I'm more than willing to do. Uh, that being said, I know you guys are going to release some new products soon. Um, I'm hoping your new device addresses these issues. So, uh, if at all possible, if I can be a beta tester for this new device that you're hopefully coming out with soon, uh, please. Uh, so I don't have to, uh, just, you know, end this video series with a bad taste in my mouth. So, uh, please get back to me. Uh, let me know if there's something I can do. Okay. Thank you.